All right, all right. I hope all is well. Um, I don't know what's taking everyone else so long to get on. I don't know what's going on, but that's fine. We're going to get started right now. I'm not going to hold you up longer when we on time. So listen, I'm super excited about what we're doing today. Test, test, make sure my mic is moving. I know one time I was on there and nobody could hear me. <laughs> Nonetheless, we're live on YouTube, we're live on Facebook, we're live on LinkedIn, and we're live on Instagram, I want to say, or Twitter, one or the other. Um, I'm super excited because so many things are happening in the real estate world right now that just make real estate so freaking awesome. Uh, the buyer's market has turned, and buyers are not able to, to control the boards. And because of that, is making back where it's balancing out. It's not a seller's market yet, but it's balancing out where the market is open for a lot of opportunities and a lot of help. So what I'm trying to do now is trying to help as many people. That's why I say it's open for a lot of help. We're trying to help a lot of people. So we're going to talk about something very basic, very easy. And what if I can tell you how you can make money just by referring deals to other people? What if I tell you that? I think that sounds super sexy. I think it sounds super awesome. So I call it driving to wealth, right? This is a way to get in and turn those dollars while you're driving into money in your pocket. All right. So a little bit for those who don't know about us, we got five, three Facebook groups. We decide five figure formula. That's everybody will make 10 grand and more. You go network with each other in there. That's the mission. Investing now, those are the people in our coach program. We give you the plan and path to work with the people in here to make money. And then once you get great at what you're doing, if you just want to be great personal growth and development, then we have Wild Way to Be Great Group, which is all about inspiring, motivating, and encouraging. And that's what we aim to do. All right. This is a PDF because I live in a country and the woods causes internet problems. So I, I just make it a PDF. So it's kind of boring when you see everything together. But hey, bear with me. I'm not going to go through this in detail because you can read for yourself, but I will say the most important thing on this slide is if you stay to the end, I'm going to give you a list of 10 motivated sellers lead you cannot refuse to learn, right? 10, 10 motivated sellers leads that you must work with. You must get five of them, maybe common sense. The other five, a little unique. All right. Again, for those who don't know, I am Coach Williams. I have put in the chat box and I will put in the chat box a couple of times a way to get on there. And I'm super also excited again. Let me go on the page. I'm super excited to say that me and Coach Joe and some of my mentees already has asked, can we do a podcast as well? Now, I had a podcast out there, 10 to Win podcast, and I do plan on shooting it out there and talking to y'all about it. So if you right now, you should have a copy of um, the audio book and the podcast links inside of the chat box if you're on, on a Zoom call, right? So we are going to be doing those as well. Now, if you want to get on my schedule, please buy this audio book, download it, listen to the first, the first chapter or two chapters, and it'll tell you a little bit more about what we're doing, why we're doing it. Then it'll also tell you how money works. So that's why I put that out there. And you'll get a 15-minute coaching call with me, right? A 15-minute coaching call where I help you with a plan and power and help you get clarity. Now, how many of you feel like you have a lack of recognition at work, a lack of recognition in your house, in your community, in your neighborhood? How many of you feel like you're undervalued? Other folks just don't get what you're doing and why you're doing it, and they don't give you the respect that you think you should deserve, or you may not be getting paid what you're worth. How many of you are stressed because every day you have bills after bills after bills coming in, and you're trying to figure out how Am I going to keep up with these bills or am I going to keep on borrowing from Paul to pay Paul, um, robbing Paul to pay Paul, right? Whatever that saying is, I can't remember what it is out there. Well, oh, robbing Peter to pay Paul. That's what it is, robbing Peter to pay Paul. <laughs> All right. So if you feel like that, you keep on moving money around and you keep trying to figure out how to stay ahead, this is for you. And then you have reduced motivation because no matter how much you do, how right you do things, Things seem like it just keep happening to you. Seem like you just can't get ahead. You make a little money, then all of a sudden the car break down. You make a little money, and all of a sudden something else happened. The kids break their arm. Something happened and cost you money. Guys, that's going to be a continuous problem. You got to do something different. And I know all these things because I'm saying what happened to me. Again, if you stay to the end, I got something for you. I'm going to give you some motivated leads to help you out. 
Now, why are you here? I hope that you learn from us. We want to teach you some strategies to go work with. We want you to earn some money from taking the actions we tell you to take. And then we want you to return back to make more money and to be a coach. That's our goal. Learn, earn, and return is our motto. We want everybody that listens to our voice to learn, earn, and return back as a coach. If you find anything that I give you tonight to be valuable, we want you to join our movement to financial security, eliminate the distraction, and live a fulfilled, purposeful life. That's what our goals is. We want you to live a fulfilled, a purposeful life, right? So take notes tonight if this makes sense. Tell others about us if we make sense. Join our communities, Facebook, Five Figure Formula, Facebook, Invest Now 2021 group, uh, Facebook, Why Wait to Be Great group, three different groups. Join them, right? Different, different methods for different reasons. Then invite other people to join as well. Appreciate your, your support. Now let's get to it, right? So these are real pictures from this weekend, right? I created these pictures this weekend. I drove for dollars, right? I did it myself. I don't tell folks do something I want to do myself. Do I like doing stuff like this? I do not. I like teaching, coaching, and motivating and helping people make money. I like doing private money lending. I like hands-off investments. That's the that's a fact. However, comma, if I'm going to tell you to do it, guess what? I lead by example and I go do what I say I need to do. So a couple of things that you want to do, you want to, this is for everybody. Understand, drive for dollars for any and everybody, right? Then you know why? You want to make money. You want to make money while you're going to work. You want to make money when you get off work. You want to make money when you go to the store and pick up something for somebody, right? And then you want to help people. You want to help people with problems. Believe it or not, everybody got a problem and you're helping them with them. So this is the house that I drove around, look at, that's my door and that's my window and this is all my stuff, right? All right, so the only way you're going to learn and benefit from this stuff is you can't quit. You got to do it. So take the ENT off and the QUI and just do it, right? Like Nike said, just do it. So some of the benefits of helping people out, you remember I told you some people that need help out, need assistance, you got people got vacant properties. If you got a vacant property, somebody got to pay tax on there. If you ain't paying taxes, the city mad, the county mad, the parish mad, the state mad, because they can't pay for doggone first responders with no money. So our taxes pay for first, first responders. So tax liens, right? You get tax liens because the house is vacant. If the house is vacant, you got grass growing up. Now you got my house looking bad because your house look bad in the neighborhood. You have the people out of the neighborhood if you have them get rid of that property. Right. And if this house is in your neighborhood, why not help somebody take that property and do something with it so you can have a better neighborhood, a better community and a nicer environment. Right. So you helping those people out that got vacant properties, they're paying taxes on something they ain't living in or those ain't paying taxes, got tax liens on them. Then you help investors out. When you refer a deal to us, we work with our investors to buy that property. If I don't buy it personally, if Coach Joe don't buy it personally, we're working with somebody to buy this property. And now you're helping us out with a problem by telling us about it. You deserve money for that. You deserve a referral fee. Guys, you go out there and tell folks about restaurants all the time. You tell folks go look at a movie all the time. You tell folks, hey, go to the fair all the time. You got paid no money. Here I am telling you, give me an address and I will pay you for the address and some pictures. Give me an address and I will pay you for the address and pictures. Guys, this is awesome. This is the way that we all can learn, earn, and return, right? Then you get a paycheck. You get a paycheck. When we close our transaction, you get money. You get paid just for referring something over to make your neighborhood look better. If that's not helping everybody out, that's crazy. Now you got retail buyers too now. I've been going to a lot of first home, uh, first-time homeowners uh, buying places, and I've been sitting down with them and find out what their struggles is, why the bank won't give them money, why they make a lot of money and the bank won't hook them up, why they can't fit in the little box that the bank got. So guess what? If you can't fit in the box that the bank got, then you got investors like myself saying, I want you to have home ownership. I'm willing to buy the property you buy from me. That's the how I do retail. If you got a house that ain't got too much wrong with it, we can sell that back. It's called um, hoteling. It's called hoteling, right? You take something pretty and just flip it over to somebody else. Yes, that is. Now, the hardest part about doing all these things in real estate, anything we do in real estate, the hardest part is the first step is the highest step. You don't know what you don't know, but after you take that first step and start taking action, the steps get smaller, guys, and you get successful. 
I'm asking you to not wait to be great. Take that first step with us. Start, join, get on my call now. Get on my, um. let me see, I just put it in the chat box. If you on here, you need to be called on, uh, download that audio book. You don't get my audio book. Then you can download that and talk to me. Get free conference call, right? That's what it will get. We'll help you out with all your steps where to get you going. So we want you to learn this method of driving for dollars, which is simple, right? We're going to break it down even more. We're going to tell you what communities that we would like you to do if you're in our neighborhood, if you're in your neighborhood, that's fine. In other communities, that's fine, right? It doesn't matter where you at. Anywhere in the world, you can do this method. And we are finding a buyer. We are find somebody that you can help to take that property off our, our, out of your neighborhood hand. Right then, we want you to refer to sellers to us, and we want you to earn big reward. We want you to earn money. So the hardest thing is the first step. Go ahead and take that first step, guys. Get on my schedule. Get on my schedule. The first step. Step one. Get on my schedule. Now, what are we looking at? Right. So I drove this weekend. And I found the house in a nice, beautiful community with boards on the window. Once I seen the boards on the window, I'm like, okay, that's a vacant house. I saw the grass growed up. Right. So the grass growed up. The house to the left, the house to the right, mad about this. Right. When you got grass growing up and trees growing all on top of your house, you ain't happy and excited about that. So if somebody can take that off your hand, that's awesome. Right. So I'm mad telling you, get up in the morning. In your neighborhood, drive one extra block. One extra block. Any houses that vacant, any houses that got high grass, any houses got mailbox that's wide open and make papers in there. I want you to write that address down and take a picture of the, the street. That way, you ain't got to stop too long. You just flash a picture of that street pole, take a picture of that mailbox with an address in it, or zoom in on the address on the house. That way, when you stop driving, you can sit down and write it all down. That's why I did this, guys. I want to make sure you understand how simple this is, right? So you take a picture, make sure you got the dog on the address of the house, when you get to the end of the road, you take a picture of the street. Now you already got a house and an address, and you can keep on driving. This is in your neighborhood. I'm telling you to make your neighborhood better by getting these empty houses filled. If the empty houses get filled, now you ain't got to worry about no yards looking like this. Trees all over the house and in front of the windows and looking like a mess. Helps everybody out. Take the picture. All right? We're going to get more about taking the pictures. All right. Now. Is this God is helping you? Put in a chat box if you think this stuff is helping you. You're finding some clarity in this. I'm giving you a goal to go do. That was a clear goal. I'm telling you, I'm guiding you through the process. We want to pay you as you go through the process. Then I'm telling you, hey, we give you a personalized approach to make your community better, to make your pocket fatter, and to learn how to look for deals in real estate. We're teaching you how to learn, earn, and return. Guys, I'm excited if you're not excited. And I told you again, I'm going to give you 10 motivated leads at the end if you stay to the end. I'm going to keep giving you as much as I can because if you're on here, you're motivating me to stay, keep talking louder, keep getting motivated, getting excited and pumping up. And then I'm also motivated as well to give more knowledge. So let's talk about this one right here. This is a house on a corner, right? I actually took a picture of this. I wasn't taking a picture of that house. I was really taking a picture of this. It just cut off. But nonetheless, Sometimes you can find deals. Let's say you don't want to drive for dollars. So this is for people in YouTube land and Facebook world say, hey, I ain't got no car. I can't drive. Guess what? You got a child. Tell your child to go on Craigslist and find deals off market. Right? Craigslist. That's a good spot to find deals. Anything say owner finance. Anything say on, uh, seller will carry. Anything that says for sale by owner. Right? Facebook marketplace. Another free source right there in your hands. I have my son know how to go on Facebook Marketplace. He know how to go to Craigslist. And he know how to do Zillow and Red uh, Realtor and Trulia. He's just turned 16 today. And he know how to do all these and find deals on, online. Guys, there's no reason why we can't be successful in making money in this business. There's no reason. So if you can't drive for dollars, then I still want to give you another way of doing it while you're at work on your lunch break in your car, while you're sitting, chilling, resting, relieving yourself while you're doing whatever you do, right? You can still scam through this stuff and find deals. Craigslist, owner finance, seller will carry, uh, willing to uh, rent to own, lease options. All those are great deals. Anything safe for sale by owner, whether it's on any site. 
that is sites that you could be making money off of and getting money paid, guys. All right, so that's what that is about. Now, another way to do it, this, this briefing is not about this, but if you want a bandit sign, that is one of my phone numbers right there. That's my one of my bandit signs right there. You can use bandit sign. Now, how do the house need to look in the neighborhood? Peeling paints, no problem. Broken windows, no problem. Rotten wood, no problem. Tall grass, right? Bad roofs and foul smelling, no problem. We're going to find somebody that specializes in those type of properties. You know, they, somebody says somebody jump is somebody else's treasure. Guys, any of those properties are good to go. I bought a house personally that had a hole in the roof, in the ceiling, and in the floor, and the foundation had shipped. I bought that house, shook it back, got it rented out right now for $700 a month and making great money. It's a two, it's a, hell, that house, yeah, two bedroom. Uh, yeah, I think two bedroom. It's tiny, it's tiny house, but I bought it because I got it for a still of a deal, right? And did all the work on there. Now, let's say you are one of those people like me. I don't like to work hard. I like to work smart. Guys, do anybody know anybody work for DoorDash? Anybody DoorDash, they're driving neighborhoods every day. All they got to do is write down a dog on the address and take some pictures. I'm going to tell you how to do the pictures. You know anybody that works for the police? Anybody police officer? Guess what? They're driving neighborhoods every day. They see in vacant houses every day. You can tell these folks to give you the addresses, and you can send the addresses to us, and you get paid. Now, if you want to break them off, that's the right thing to do. I'm never going to tell nobody to shortchange anybody on money but you break off how much you want to break them off. You get paid your check, they get paid what they get because they did a bonus. They can get on this call and learn it, but you're learning something they don't know. So I'm teaching you a way to make money. Now, you can go out there to post services, postal service, anybody delivering post to the office, they know what mail is full, what mailbox ain't getting no mail because nobody live there. They know what houses are vacant. They got a list of everything. Guys, you can refer to these folks right here. You can tell them, hey, give me my addresses and the names. Go by that house, take the pictures, and then send them over. That's a way you can get paid. Uber, Lyft drivers. I'm not going through all this list. Y'all know it. Y'all see it. Stay to the end if you want to know 10 motivated ways. If this ain't motivation enough, I don't know what motivation enough is. I'm giving you so many ways you can make money. You can make money yourself. You can tell folks to go work for you, and they don't even know they're working for you. All these people. That's just name a few. There's so many more. I didn't you I didn't put UPS on there. It's a whole bunch of folks I can think of that delivers and go through neighborhoods on a daily basis. Guys, I'm helping you out. Again, no no point intended in www.investnow2021.com. No point intended. That's my bandit sign right there. In foreclosures, I can help. That's my phone number. If you decide that you want to dial it, call it, send a message. Hey. There you go, 24 hours. Hey, this is recorded on YouTube. This is recorded on LinkedIn. I am throwing a shout out there. If you have a house, a junker, anywhere, text that number, that information. Text that. Text the pictures of the house, that information. Go to my website. That's fine. Learn more about me. I want you to. Now, what we're looking for, foreclosures, letters on the door, the windows, foundation issues, no problem. Vacant houses, again. Open mailboxes, again. The mailbox been open for a whole week. Come on now. I know that mailbox ain't that broke. Ain't nothing, and if you see a whole bunch of papers in there, come on now. Hey, that thing right there is available. What's the worst you can do? You send an address and we, they still decide to sell, even if they live there. Send the address and find out. So here's what testimony. Coach T, that's who I am. I'm Coach T. Thank you. Uh -huh. He's an incredible compassionate. Oh, yeah, y'all can see that. Helpful and uplifting. I think I'd uplift y'all, right? So that person did not lie. And what I did was, if you notice, this is a hyperlink. That hyperlink is a real review. I'm not one of these people that cut and paste somebody that's reviewing. I cut and paste each one of my reviews into this PowerPoint so you can see it. So you can see the rest of it. I am a purposeful entrepreneur. I am trying to help as many people as possible. And I appreciate Sarah for that shout out. So I just want to let you know that some people think I, I know what I'm talking about. And I'm happy. Now, how to spot out opportunities and get moolah, baby. Get that moolah, right? That baby, right? That paid. How to get paid. This is how you get paid. Vacant properties, like I said. Vacant lots. People in North Carolina want vacant lots. Write down the address, take pictures. What are we taking pictures of? I'm glad you asked. You take a picture of the subject property. 
house in the left with the subject property so we can know that that house is to the left of it and a subject property in the house to the right. That give us a good idea of that neighborhood. Right there, just that alone, if you could do that three, those three pictures, those are three pictures. Now, I recommend the mailbox. That way, if you're driving and you don't want to stop and nobody be, what he doing? Why they doing this and that? And take a picture of the mailbox and the end of the road, the street sign, because the mailbox usually had an address number on there. The street sign had an address on there. You took the pictures of the house. Later on, we can do that, right? You can write it down on your spreadsheet, write down your Excel document and do that, right? So get on my schedule. If this sounds like something you want to get paid to do, then get on my schedule. Download the audio book at, um, at audiobook.investingnow2021.com. Download it. Get on my calendar so I can hook you up with your spreadsheet and tell you exactly how it's going to work from that day forward. So you can start getting checks every month, every month. And hopefully you'll be making five figures, five figures, right? So any questions, take pictures to the left, take pictures to the right, take pictures in the middle, right? And take a picture of the mailbox, take a picture of the roadside, just in case you don't want to stop and write all that stuff down. And you get paid. Hey, all right, so this is me driving. I took a picture of this house because that house was directly across the street from another nice home. And I wanted to show people how nice, and all these pictures are in the same neighborhood. So all these pictures I'm showing you on here, this is all the stuff I did this weekend while I'm driving, right? So these are nice homes and nice neighborhoods. The house has got tall grass, got stickers on the windows, or either the mailbox got wide open and it got mail in it, stuff like that. So that's what made me know it. So, uh-oh, put an old slide in here. <laughs> All right, so don't worry about that. That's my other slide. All right, but I just started cutting pictures. So this is the one that matters. All right, so no actions is an action. If you don't take action and get my audio book, then guess what? You just took an action. You decided to wait off and put off and keep on the same frustration, keep on not going to the same job, not working none different, not make, being able to make more money. You just keep on doing the same thing over and over again, right? Also, if you don't want to, if you want to be in a fight where you don't have to worry about your bills by using a source, right? Using a strategy to make a little extra money, then put that money that you're making extra into an investment strategy to make that money make money and start being passive income, then this is what it's about, right? If you don't want to make a decision to retire early, if you don't want to make a decision to go on vacations and send people on vacation and pay for vacation for other people, retire your mom, retire your uncle, buy your uncle the car his dream. If you don't want to do those things, then don't do this. Because I'm telling you exactly what I did. Everything I said don't do, that's what I'm doing, right? So if you don't want to create a generational wealth strategy, don't take no action. Just don't. Don't. And you won't have seat covers with your face on it. <laughs> you won't have all this crap that I got over here, guys. And that's that stick on the window. Remember I told you, you got a stick on the window? They go to stick on the window. That's the yard of that house. That's the same house right there. Pretty house. Nothing wrong with it. Look at that window. Got a sticker on it. That's a pretty house we can retail sell to somebody. And you can help that neighborhood out by getting this property off their hands. God, that's nice. So if you want this moolah, then this is what Diana said about me. Letaris is an outstanding coach who has greatly helped me navigate the confusion and uncertainties I was experiencing as I prepared for retirement. In just 30 minutes, he guided me towards discovering my true passion and staying committed to it. Guys, it don't take long when you ask the right questions. It don't take long. I probably got to that in probably 10 minutes. But extra talking, extra getting to know her is what's said to 30 minutes. Guys, it don't take long. Get on my calendar so we can get clarity on what you're trying to do. Let's set you some goals and let's start aiming for them going forward. That's what Diana did. Again, no harm, no foul. This is hyperlink to show you that that is a real live doggone um, um, testimony, right? So you can go there on my website and see it for yourself. Why wait to be great? So for those who still on, I'm going to give you 10 motivated sellers lead sources so that you can get that information. At the same token, if you want to be very intentional and know that we're going to close on a deal, this is what we're looking for, guys. We're looking for houses like this. Now, we'll take any house, any house of work. I'm not trying to discard any other house, but when it comes down to getting a house sold fast and quick, this is your criteria. 
40% equity, right? That's, a, that's how much equity you want in that property. That way the person can do the burn method and be successful if that investor like bird, right? You want square footage, 1,200 square feet to 3,000 square feet. Why do they want 1,200 square feet? Because I can add a bathroom in that house. I can add a bedroom in that house. If it's a two bedroom, one bath, I can add an extra bed in there. If it's a three bedroom, one bath, I can add an extra bath in there. That's called burn it, baby. That's called burn it. And if you got 1,200 square feet, you can make it happen. And that's just called creating value. For those who don't know what burn mean, it means to buy, to rehab, to rent out, to refinance, and to repeat. That's what it mean. You buy it, you rehab it, you refinance, you rent it out, then you refinance and you repeat that over and over again. That's what burn means. The minimum value is 75000 Why do we want a minimum value? That's not very crucial, but it is good to know because if you really want somebody that don't have no problem going to the bank and finance, you don't want nothing less than $50,000. So we just throw the 25000 up there. So that, hey, that's the minimum. That's the minimum, right? But hey, guys, $15,000 fine, $20,000 fine, it doesn't matter. Just sometimes when we deal with certain people, they don't want to have no problem with the bank. They don't have all that cash on hand, so they use this as a norm, right? Now, preferred, why $150,000? That's a first-time homeowner's sweet spot. But it's $150,000, that is a sweet spot. A sweet spot means that most folks can afford that much. When you get $200,000, uh, the bank don't want to lend everybody that much money, right? So one fifty dollars is a sweet spot for a quick Clothes. All right, three bedroom, two baths. I hope y'all like my little my little ad lift and my my funny talking. Now this is kind of tiny, but you can go to Invest Now on YouTube channel if you want to see this in detail. And if you join our program, we give you this handout. So we have buyers in all these areas. We have buyers in all these areas. Any zip codes I write down and I keep that means I got a buyer for that area. We got buyers in these areas. Georgia, North Carolina, Rayford, um, um, Riley, I'm sorry, um, do got Rayford too, but Rayford is um, over here in North Carolina. Um, Maryland, Chicago, Virginia, uh, San, South Carolina. Then, for those who don't know, I, well, that's why we got to talk about parishes. I'm from Louisiana, of course. I'm still buying in Louisiana, but I live in Atlanta. I live in um, North Carolina. I have houses in Mississippi. I have houses in Virginia. Right, we started buying, and I'm steady buying in these areas. I got a best friend say he want an apartment complex, so I say, hey, I better throw a shout out there for him, right? With minor work. So these are details that buyers all told me they want, right? These are details that buyers told me they want. So these are the people we got already buying. Again, we got Georgia, North Carolina, Maryland, Chicago, Ohio, Virginia, South Carolina, uh, Louisiana. And that's all Louisiana stuff. I just put it on one thing so that I can know Louisiana people, right? Um, again, if you want to get on my schedule and get a part of this and be a part of this, go ahead and download my audio book now, right? Download that audio book. It's in the chat box for those who just got on a, on a Zoom call. For those who are on Facebook, you can see it. For those who are on YouTube, you can see it. For those who are on Twitter, you can see it. For those who are on LinkedIn, you can see it. Audiobook.investingnow2021.com. Now, who are your sellers? Guys, they possibly could be somebody getting divorced, right? Unfortunately, somebody got to move out. A lot of time, both of you got to move out and split the profit. So they got to get out, right? You, unfortunately, some people, you know, at a certain age in life where they have to transition to their final resting spot for right now until they walk again or raise again. So probate, they pass, right? You have people that bankrupts. They need you to let them out of it. They need you to help them with that piece. Get this off my hands for what I work. You got people have back taxes. Need you to get this off my hands. Guys, these are sellers. These are possible sellers. So many more, right? I told you I'm going to hook you up with the leads. Y'all stay to the end. So there's some leads right there. There's five great leads. Pre-foreclosure, divorce, probate, bankruptcy, and back taxes. Then you have, oh, wow, oh, man. I guess I got excited about the bank taxes. I put on that twice. Sorry. I <sighs> don't have to be that smart, huh? Now you got liquidated. People that want to liquidate, right? They say that, hey, I, my kids don't want these properties. I just need to get rid of them. So I'm ready to sell it all for a discount. There you go. They liquidate. You got people that downsize market. The market 
change. They rather pay off some debts and do some different things. Right. You got people that bought a new home and said, hey, I don't want that old home. Let me get out of it. I got to move out of town. That's the other one. They moving out of town. They need to sell. So there you go right there. Um, I don't know which one I left off. I forgot one of them in there, but I'm sorry about that. So what we ask you to do is try and partner with us. That's what we want you to do. Partner with us so we can help you get started in real estate. Take that big step. That first step is the hardest step. The first step you need to take right now is get on my schedule, download my audio book, and let's chit chat. Let's have a conversation, right? The reason why I ask you about the audio book is so that you can listen to how money works, understand how money works, and keep revisiting how money works. If you don't, you may know how, but I think I can definitely enlighten you on different ways. Our community wants you to achieve your number one goal. That's the most important thing we can help you do. Achieve your number one goal, right? So you got to plan for success to do that. And that's what we want you to do. And the way you plan for success is by meeting with people like myself, uh, getting on my schedule, and let's figure out how we can have a plan path for you. Driving for dollars is what we try and do for you. We want you to be great. We want you to make a lot of money. We want you to be wealthy. And we want you to succeed. You just got to want it for yourself. If you want it for yourself, we're here out here. People out here that want you to win, you just got to take the action. We can't do it for you. You got to do it yourself. We can tell you. We can lead you. You have to do it yourself. Now, again, I got a podcast that we're going to start back. 10 to win podcast, retiring 10. Uh, myself and Joe going to go live having um, conversations about what's going on in life, what's going on in real estate. I have mentees that I have mentioned this to. They said, Coach, I would love for you to interview me in front of everybody and let folks know what you're doing so they can kind of hear from the horse's mouth themselves. And I got folks that other people are saying, hey, I would like to come and spread good gospel and help people out as well. I have to drop a little early. All right, I understood. We'll hopefully get on my schedule, Miss Magnat. Please get on my schedule. Um, I, I am looking forward to working with y'all. I'm looking forward to help you meet your goals. I look forward to you achieving. What questions y'all have? That is the end of the presentation. I did what I supposed to do to help you out and to make you understand that you can make money in this program. I do want to say that you got three choices. You can freeze and say, I ain't going to do nothing. You can fight and say, I ain't coming back. Or you can fight and take action, right? You can do this stuff, right? And that's what we want you to do. We want you to do it, right? We want you to do it. Oh, uh-oh. I moved the wrong slides around. That's what happened. So a little interesting information. If you decide to sign up, I'm here with free searches. So some of you ought to stay on, get more information. Fast people search. If you want to find the actual owner of those properties, you got white pages search, you got true people search. These are all links that work to help you find for free the information to those properties. Right? And that's how you can get paid a bigger check by supporting and bringing some more to the table. So by you staying to the end, you got a little bit more information, a little bit more information. Now, I need to go fix my slide. I got this stuff all over the place. All right, what y'all got? Any questions? Any questions? What question you have? Raise your hand. I'm looking at the chat box or go from there. How you want to do it? Hey, Joe, I'm going to unmute you, man. I hope you, if, so you can bring some light to here. I know you like to say something. Who's Joe? Oh, all right. Oh, that's a different coach. <laughs> all right. So anybody have anything? I'm looking at the chat box. I don't see anything. All I seen was a message. One person told me they had to drop off a little early, but they would appreciate it. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> he said, I'm here. All right, coach. Hey, hey, what's going on, my man? I I, I think it's uh uh yeah, I don't know, know who you was uh I'm muting there. But... <laughs> I know, right? But but no, man, I, I got to tell you, man, uh, I love driving for dollars. You know, that's where I've uh, gotten my biggest uh, opportunities at. And and I've gotten uh, driving for dollars, uh, properties that I've did fix and flips, properties that I've done uh, buy and hold, kept them as rental properties, uh, properties I've done subject to where the sellers didn't even want the property anymore. They just signed the property over to me. So I love, love, love uh, doing um uh, driving for dollars. In fact, coach, the last deal that we uh, acquired, that property there we picked up for 115000 
and uh, the ARV on it is, I believe, 250, 255, you know, ballpark it. And it's going to take about uh, $40,000 to get it ready. So that's a ton of equity there, a ton of opportunity. So I love the drive for dollars. I love the concept of uh, offering people the opportunity to uh, work with you, um, you know, learn the process as, as you know, you know uh, they go and, and get paid for it. You know, that, that's that's a great way. So uh, I love it, man. I greatly appreciate it, bro. Pre greatly, greatly, greatly appreciate it. Thank you for the confirmation. Man, people know the type of deals you acquire by doing this. Oh, yeah, I man. I, I love it. Love it. Uh, subject to, again, um, fix and flips and rental properties. And and a lot of these times, Coach, um, you know, these houses, they don't need anything. You know, sometimes you get a house in that good of a condition. You know, in fact, you know, I got two houses that are like they share the, the backyard fence. So if the fence ever goes down, I know I'm responsible for uh, replacing it. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> so, so, yeah, yeah, I know I'm, I'm responsible for, for re, uh, replacing it. Which, <laughs> however, I got both of those subject to. Driving for dollars, subject to. So um, whenever I got one property under contract and I said, hey, do you, you know, own the house behind you? And in, in fact, they did because they shared the property line and uh, on the fence. And, and I called them and they had moved out to Minden and they were just like, yeah, I'm done with the house. You know, they moved on uh, some land. They they tried to sell it, couldn't sell it. And they gave up. I said, don't give up. Have no fear. Coach Joe is here. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that house, coach. Look at that house. That house clean. Let me see. Let me see here. Uh, yeah, yeah, that house clean. Where is this is the neighborhood that I drove this weekend. That's the empty mailbox. That's why I said they own the empty mailbox. There's the house to the next, to the right of it. Here's the house to the left of it. Uh, nope, that's the same house. So the, I'll take the picture of the, uh, how did I do that? Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, but that's the house. That's a clean house. There's a lot of them. I said I had a lot of nice neighborhood houses that was really clean. They were vacant. And I ain't put all the pictures on here, but it's so many. That was the one with the window. With the, that's a nice house. This house is nice. Yep. So, all right. Well, now I appreciate you for sharing, Coach. Thank you for the confirmation. Um, everybody, uh, you have any questions? Any questions? Any questions? No questions. Well, I appreciate everybody getting a call. Thank you. I hope you're enlightened. I hope you're excited about what we have for you. And we're looking forward to working with you. Again, the audio book is audiobook.investing2021.com. It helps you to understand how money works. It helps you with goals and alignments. It talked about my story, how I did it, why I did it, and why I'm doing what I'm doing now. Um, that's just one of my audio books. I got another book coming out. I already had the book came out, Matthias the Eagle. That's a baby book. Teaching about financial freedom. I have a child that's two years old, and I want my my son to learn the alphabet to my words. So I wrote purpose. I want to say I want to do. I don't need no to do it. I can do. So I'm going to do this with help. Take care. Be safe. Thank y'all for being on.